Hey guys, and welcome back to the weekly episodes. My name is Darren Gerg, and thank you for joining me. So, we're in a new episode. The Last Treasure. So, this is uh, still in Silent Ground. It's very different than the one of the Brainstorm Pony. Yeah, we got it. It's different than the Brainstorm Pony. Thank you. Uh, blah, blah, blah. He was a friendly fellow, but it's important not to stay in comfort for too long, or the whole journey will be endangered. You already said that last week. I said this was a dark and uh, dreary place, but look at those two men in the corner! Yeah, Wivla and Andronia? They seem to be colorful characters and do not fit in with the rest of the assemblage. Let us see what got them out worked up. So we just get five badges today, no no title. Oh, those two guys. Well, they do look kind of... You are very colorful. Hello there, can I help you with something? Unless you must have heard my name and decide to hear more of my exploits, oh my god. It is always a pleasure to speak with such admirers. I was just telling Haley here of some of my greatest finds and she was held in rapt attention as no doubt you be as well. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I am the great Theodore Gors, master treasure seeker and wanderer of the wildlands. If there is treasure to be found, in the hidden places of this world, I have already been there and found it. My deeds are extensive and well documented, and my virtues similarly well known. So what are you saying, you have all 19s? Man, show off. I'm so accomplished in this sphere that only one thing remains for me. To retire. Oh my god. <laughs> Theodore claimed to be a master treasure seeker, and will do so at great length to anyone who will listen. Sadly, that appears uh, to be me for the moment. Anyone can claim to be a great seeker of treasure. In point of fact, anyone can do the seeking. It is the finding that separates those with actual accomplishments from the pretenders. I guess we're gonna go on a treasure hunt. I have had a great idea. Theodore could train me to become a treasure seeker. Let's turn up the sound a little bit. Yeah, he could train you. I think it's a bad idea. That's better. Idea. Theodore could train me to become a treasure seeker. <laughs> Has occurred to me that so far much of my manuscript involves spending time in taverns and becoming a treasure seeker will get us out into the wildlands. I will, it will make for better reading. That is for certain. Will you ask him? Well, why don't you ask him? All right. What's that? Your hobbit friend wants to become a treasure seeker. I would love to teach him, but alas, it is n it's not something that can be easily taught. If he does not have the natural proclivity for such adventures, he will be restrained to any training I might give to him. Also, I'm about to retire, and I intend to spend my time regaling Haley here with tales of my interesting and eventful life. So I would appreciate being left alone to do so. Ah, I do not mean to be so brusque. Here, take this riddle. It's apparently a clue to a treasure somewhere in the Lonelands. A treasure I never found. Even some of the best and blah blah blah. If the two of you can solve this riddle and find the treasure, perhaps I will be able to teach the both of you something after all. Good luck and goodbye. Oh my god. Alright, so, riddle. The torn flows blanketed in the shadow of early only morning. A sentinel stares from on high, only he still watches, so that's probably the tower. The red squirrel once dared to climb, but time fails all. Do you do a doctor? May I see the riddle? Mm. Oh, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. So obviously, I think we have water top, we have a torn, it's a waterfall, the red scroll. I'm not sure about the red scroll. We'll find out. Will it actually give us a quest tracker? If not, great. I don't think it gives us a quest tracker. Wow. All right. Torn flows, blanketed in the shadows of only morning. That, that's gotta be a, a waterfall. I'm probably gonna make an idiot out of myself today. 
Uh, a sentinel stares from on high, only he still watches, and the red squirrel once dared to climb, but time fails all. What's the red squirrel? Fire? Huh. Or maybe up here. We have the red pass, but there's no torrent here, is there? I know there's waterfalls up here. I do not remember if there are waterfalls back here. Well, I guess there's one here. But there's no watcher here. I mean, a watcher gotta, gotta refer to the most prominent feature, which is, you know, weather top. And somehow I find this, that there's probably nothing here. The red squirrel once dared to climb, but time fells all. So something t uh, grew up there. Uh, it could be a reference to a rune. Well, we have our watcher up here. Gonna have a waterfall back here. So that's the only waterfall I can think of. I still don't know what the red squirrel is. The time fells all. That's a, maybe that's a watcher. Not sure. The red squirrel once dared to climb, but time fells all. Could be a tree, I guess. So there's gotta be a tower close by. Oh, that's not really a watcher. Well, there, there we go. Dead? Come on. That would have been too easy. What is this then? That's probably just for more quest. That's ah, gotta be for more quest. <clears throat> so let's check these waterfalls first and then we'll move on. Torrent flows blanketed in the shadow of only morning. What's well, not around here? Trying to see if I missed it somewhere. Red squirrel once dared to climb, but time fills all. It's a big landslide here, I guess. Maybe a sentinel them don't mean weather top, but a, a statue. It's gotta be the red pass, maybe. But what torrent? The last bridge could be a sentinel? I don't know. This could be a tough one. This could take me a while to find. I don't know if, if you guys want to <laughs> watch me running around the Lone Lands trying to figure out where this place is. Time falls out. It's gotta be a rune. The torrent flows. And this says. Uh, from on high only. Maybe it's in better top. I mean, that's that's the other choice. And then uh, it's more turning about the uh, the morning. 
Ooh, gonna make this. That's a little bit too steep, huh? Come on. I mean, really, this is my other idea. It kind of uh, messes up to that you could pass it and don't even know. If it would at least give you like a big area or something, or clues that you can find. That would be nice. You know, like a Witcher style thing. Are we up on the top? You don't see anything. What has surprised me? The torrent flows blanketed in the shadow of only morning. Hmm. Really thought those would mean up here. Where else? I mean, there's there's no torrent. There's a lot of water here, but again. It could be really over here. Well, what's this? <laughs> Found Floyd and the Wit in the Lone Nets. I have no idea what this is. We have to find him in different places. Well, if you need to find Floyd, the the vid, the explorer, he's right here in the Lone Lands. I I know there was a deed for that. The Red Squirrel. It's gotta be that Red Squirrel. What could I mean with that? I don't know. I'm gonna think about this. I'm probably gonna put a cut near because it might take me half an hour or so to find this. And that might be pretty boring to watch. Oof. I gotta think about this one. Once dared to climb the time fossil. The red screw the guy that refer to. What could that refer to? Tree? Fire? Water. I mean, the red kind of pushes me over here to the red pass. But what torrent? Alright, guys, I'll, I will think about this and then hopefully I will find it, put in the cut, and then I'll see you in a second. Ah uh, guys, welcome back. It took me about 20 minutes, but I did find it finally. Um, I was right, it is weather top. Right here, I'm gonna show you how you can get there. Uh, that's really a, bla a bad, I don't know. I don't think it was a very clear riddle on what's going on here. So, I'm gonna show you how you get to it. So, first of all, just go down to this dude right here in uh, Glamhello. Yeah, this dude right there. Well, I think Glamhello is at ca our camp here. So everybody knows this uh, this guy. He has some quests and stuff. There you go. What's his name? Can can rave where you do book two. Find him. Should be right here. Right there is encampment. Thirty point two south, thirty seven point nine west. What you do then is you just move up. And I forgot that there's a little waterfall here as well. So we have a waterfall here that Hornflow's blanket in the shadows of only morning. 
that should have been a hint, you know. Sun rising in the east, right? Is that correct? Yeah, it's rising in the east, so once in the west, it should always be there. So it should have been a hint that something's on the west side. Well, here it is. Uh, a sentinel stares from height, only he still watches. There you go. There we got our sentinel up there. The only one left. There's none here. And then the red scroll once dared to climb, but time fells off. That still is a bad one. It's just like, well, maybe he means fire to try to get up there. But I figured, okay, we gotta go up to that sentinel. He is watching, so. What you do is you go up here to the, to the left. I don't know, that's not a very a good riddle. I think a lot of people are gonna have trouble finding this. Uh go up to the sentinel. There he is. Then a red scroll once tried to climb, but time fell all. Huh I was like, what what could this mean? Till you see this tree down here, right? A tree fell down. I don't know what it means. It's actually, we really mean a wax squirrel. Is the lightning supposed to hit it? That last one still does not make any sense to me. I don't know what the red scroll means. But you go down here. And you probably want to dismount. And voila. You're right here. Find the strong box. I still don't know what the red scroll refers to. Oh well. Storm is empty save for a single parchment container cryptic phrases. Oh no! There's more! Hey, okay, so we gotta go back to this. This I actually, you know, even I think the hint line could have been better, at least give you a starting point or at least, you know, kinda contain it a little bit. Um. Still definitely one of the better weekly episodes because it kinda, you know leads you around Middle Earth here. That guy just found a torrent. It's up there. Maybe I was just stupid for not figuring this out first uh fast. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I died. Well that should take us back to the Forsaken End faster. So of course that was planned. There you go. We are right back at the Forsaken Inn. Just a little shortcut. <coughs> of course. Right. <laughs> Alrighty, so... What do you mean you solved the riddle and found the treasure? I don't believe it. Disappointed? I'm not disappointed at all. Do you see what this means? This means that someone else found the treasure first and replaced it with this message. Someone beat the master treasure seeker at his own game. This retirement is off. I have a treasure to find. Oh god. I think you gave Theodore the best treasure of all. Really you said there was no treasure in that strong box, but I think you are not quite correct to that score. I think you gave Theodore the best treasure of all. A reason to keep going. Now he's excited about his profession again once again and he does not need to spend his days reveling in adventures of his youth. He can have all new adventures. Perhaps uh, his will intersects with ours for the time too. There's still a treasure out there after all. So we get our five badges. And you didn't go out again. It was me. I did all the adventuring. You were just standing there. Good job. Awesome. And that's my title by the way. Alright. Well, thanks for watching guys. I hope I could help you finding the right location. And if if I spoiled it for you, I'm sorry. But that's it. That's that's it. <laughs> See you guys next week with uh, the next episode. Thank you and bye.